In this session, we'll talk about pilot study. Before we start, I really have to say, if you go on YouTube and search about like all sorts of video talking about IA, uh, you find out pilot study. This session has been much, much underrated. Many people didn't even include this part, and I'll explain to you why this is important and why you must include this in your IA if you want to score high. Before we talk about how we write it, let's talk about the reason why we need to do pilot study first. So first of all, of course, uh, we want to score better, and that is referring to the pattern engagement because in this case, it can really show to the market that why you do this and do that and design your experiment later on. And that will also affect the methodology, which means uh, the exploration will also be uh, improved as well. More practically speaking, uh, when you do a pilot study, that means before you actually do your final investigation, uh, you also want to see whether your result uh, will be obvious. And that is to say, within your independent variable range, for example, uh, maybe you are doing how temperature affects something, so maybe you can do uh, 20 degrees Celsius to 100 degrees Celsius at the end, but then during your first study, maybe you want to pick simply 20 degree and 100 degree and see uh, whether or not it will give a good result for dependent variable. Maybe, just maybe, when you do the experiment, uh, you find out hey, with these two extreme, you also get maybe only 5% of change in your dependent variable, then maybe this is not. A good methodology for you to try or not a good range for you to try so maybe there's something you want to change in that case you can either change the range you can either change the methodology or even you can think about changing the control variable so that maybe the dependent variable will be uh, having a greater range so this is something that we do and also uh, something to consider before you do the actual investigation. Another example that I can use to help explain why the policy is important uh, could be a research question related to Doppler's effect. So in case you are in SL, you may not know this. This is about how a moving source of sound can emit uh, the sound with a frequency that is appear to be higher or lower. So um, in the experiment, the student probably having a ball which uh, has a buzzer inside emitting the sound and they want to change the frequency and see how the apparent frequency will change. Um, but the thing is, because of the speed that they, rank, they reach is not high enough. So maybe at the end they find out or oh, even by calculation the frequency that you could actually change is just probably 3% only. So it's really not enough for you to uh, calculate anything or measure anything because probably at the end, the change of frequency is probably only like uh, 5 Hertz only. right? So it's not actually measurable because the uncertainty of finding out frequency is probably like 1 or 2 Hertz already. So one way of changing it if you could somehow ma uh, manipulate the control variable because in this experiment the original frequency is a constant right it's one of the control variable so if you can actually maybe multiply this frequency or change the frequency uh, 10 times larger uh, and of course assuming that it is still within the audible range that is uh, measurable by your equipment then Obviously, even though it is still 3% with the same uh, speed limit, then the delta F probably will also be 10 times greater. So it will be like 50 hertz right, for the change. So probably it's more measurable in terms of the absolute value. So this is uh, an example to show you how you can change the control variable uh, in your research questions to, so that your measurement can be more reliable and probably not affected by the random error as well. So really, pilot study is a way to help you to get evidence. So because you try it, right, you may try like randomly or you try by trial and error of different control variable. And then you may find out for maybe a certain setup, you can get the probably the best range of dependent variable. 
and this is a way to justify uh, your choices of uh, the range of independent variable and also the setting of control variable. So to summarize, what to write under the section of pilot study uh, will be talking about the those trial runs that you do. And for each trial run, you may want to talk about the choice of control variable because you may have changed the control variable for each trial, right? So then you can see which one can give you a more obvious result. And also, uh, you will also, of course, describe the range of the independent variable as well and see whether you can extend it even more. Sometimes it may not be related to the control variable itself. It may, like, a more major issue could be uh, methodology so it, I will just say uh, stay what problems that you face you find here so it may not just be controllable it could be really something else that you may not be able to solve directly so maybe you wait you could uh, change the methodology so then uh, you can do something more meaningful and the data is also measurable and uh, suitable for analyze later and there are also cases where uh, some of the students that I encountered in the past, uh, they have planned so well, they try to execute their procedure and collect the data. And even by the time when they collect the data, they try to plot the graph. Eventually, they find out there isn't much clear trend or maybe the random error is too large. And at the end, they kind of get to redo the whole experiment again. Uh, in that case, you can also put all this effort that, that, that you have spent on the previous study into this so-called pilot study. All right, so pilot study is something that you can talk about uh, something maybe failed uh, at the first place and then how you can make a change in the design of the final investigation at the end. So again, uh, the whole purpose is to justify why you make the final design and also uh, hopefully to impress the market that you really personally engage into this topic. So make sure you try to explain uh, all the consideration as much as possible.